Hello peeps, I am Eleven Eleven Co. Today I want to look at the lies. Once you realise things, you see the lies. Real lies, real lies. What lies? Well the lies are everywhere. It feels like everything's a lie. And when you look into things, you see the lie. And it leads you to the truth. I feel these lies are there to imprison our mind, like as in the matrix, is a construct to maybe control your mind, use your power for you, instead of using it yourself. And what I've realised over time of on my journey is seeing the lies in in religion, science, school, history, medicine. You know, there's a, there's a lot going on. And yeah, I'll tell you what, I'll put something down on a bit of paper to show you more in depth what I'm talking about. And then put this down. That's what I see. I see, see these, these aren't all theories what they're lying about, but here's, a, here's the list of few where I see with the fear separation, medicine, food, history, religion, science, school, media, phone, and money. There's a lot of lies there. And that all controls your belief system under one umbrella. So if you believe in all this, if you adhere to all of this, then I fear that you will be trapped in a matrix of control. So controlling your belief system if you believe all this. You know, I was one of them, or pretty much one of them. And then I started seeing the lies. I started realising things for myself. That's all I'm trying to do is highlight it. I've got anagrams there and lexigrams and embedded meaning as I see them in words. That's why I've titled it based on fact. Or well, sorry, lies. That's how I see it. Right, let's look at fear. Fear is only in your ear. Take the F off. It's in your ear. So it's only what you're hearing. So you don't have to fear nothing. Fear keeps you trapped. I.e. separation. You separate the people. You can conquer them, can't you? A lot easier with separation. A lot of people feel separate. And with the medicine. I mean, you've got, you've got healing prophecies yourself. You can heal yourself. You don't need medicine. So that's like for money. I see that. You know, I've got alternatives. I'm just looking through the control, as in like your food as well. You're not educated up on the food, what we should be eating, what we shouldn't be eating so much, really. You know, it's all fast food, or a lot of it is. It's like our history as well, looking to our history. I see that as his story, and that's been changed a bit. The history only goes back, what, about 6,000 years? I know I've been here a lot longer than that. It's like religion, how long has that been about? I mean, that don't go back that far, does it? Same with science. Science is about the senses, only your five senses you have here, when you have six and plus, you have a lot more than six senses. But science only refers to the five senses. It's like school. When you go to school, they're going to learn you about all this, all this history, the medicine, the separation, the food. So you can try when you get older, by the media, and by your phone. You know, if you've got your head down looking at your phone all the time, you're not looking up for one. And this is all genetic, it's all physical stuff. You know, there's no mes- metaphysical here. You know, your religion talks about metaphysical stuff. But me, I think it's all designed on your ego. All this, on his ego, phone and media, you know. You penetrate people's ego without controlling them a lot easier. Because part of the ego brings along mental health. You know, all this brings about addiction to sex, drugs, alcohol, gambling, food. You know, addiction to food, pills. That's what this all brings about. As we know, because we're living it. And if you look at anagrams and exograms, they bring up a lot. I call it embedded meanings. Like, if you look at the word religion. 
it's just live like that, like even like no. and sense. So you're only given five senses. You know history is his story. That's your story. You see how history how you want to see it. I can change a lot of this just by going into this. Show you alternative. If you're doing this, then you're probably not doing the other. Let's compare. That's what I fear. I love. Love and compassion. You'll have no fear there. That set you free. Separation, you're never alone. We're all one, so you're never alone. Same as medicine. You can swap out for plants, herbal stuff, use your mind to heal yourself. And food, I like my words. Is that anagram of green? Is that for energy? But for energy, you've got the word green. Maybe green foods. Same as religion, swap religion, spirituality. Maybe. Meditation. Some days, with your eyes closed. The hidden mind is, that's make that pineal. Science, yeah, you can swap science for physics. And that big one. I'll get you a bit closer, because the real science is hermetics. Well, the original name was comedics. But we, we know now it as hermetics. That shows you more than anything else. As for school, well, if you finish school, then that's already been done. If you're in school, or oh, maybe I don't know the answer. Maybe a bit of home tuition. Or try and separate the subjects and get something out of some of what can help you on this side as opposed to this side. Same with, same with the media. Like, don't entertain media, news, and all these other type things of media. You know, swap that for like books. You know, maybe nature. YouTube's obviously. Watch videos. If you're watching this one now, maybe. And, um, and the same with the phone. Like the phone, don't use it for all that social media. If you're not using your phone, things like YouTube, calling, texting. Maybe you're crossing out of this mind-based control system. Free in your mind. So you're free your mind on this side. You won't be controlled by the matrix. That's why that's what I see it. Then you'll get to learn about things like I am and the sun, your thoughts, your words, numbers. You, know, you are a creator. That's when you know you're free and when you feel that you're, you're creating your own reality. So if it does turn out in a negative way, it's still all good. It can't be all positive all the time. Because then you won't know if you're going wrong. You're going off your path. You have to stick to your path with positivity. Then you know you're on your path. You get a lot of neg negativity in your life. Maybe not on it. Maybe you're far from it. It's all about your thoughts and feelings. That's how we can create your new belief systems. And um, then de deprogram the old ones. And then you'll start realising. And you'll see the lies. You'll have your real eyes on them. Well, this is how I see it. It's just in my interpretation of how I see things. I think I'm done. I'm out. And I love you all. I'm here for you all. I am 11. 11 code.